good afternoon, people. Okay, so today we are at Katong. So many of you guys request for this chicken rice, this specific chicken rice bro. Delicious boneless chicken rice, okay? The, I think now is the second generation. The son is like some very handsome guy. <laughs> His name is Soki. I got in touch with him. He allowed me to film. Yeah, which is good. Because I heard that Food King got rejected three times or something. So uh, it's a good thing we we're here to film. Uh, I'm gonna try out this chicken rice. I'm gonna quote Food King. I got in Ryan. He said this is the best chicken rice in the entire Singapore. It gets very subjective when it comes to chicken rice, so we're just gonna try out. Pass them a big plate already. I'm gonna get them to, you know, fill it up and see what we can do. It's been a while, I want to I want to really enjoy a good plate of chicken rice today. Okay, let's go see what we got to do. I just need my plate to be full kind of How close, how soon? Okay, so we're gonna let him do out the plating because I don't know how to. Look at look at him, he's like a master here. Yeah. Alright guys, so this is the this is the second gen owner. Hello. Very good looking. You guys want to girls, guys, whoever want to come over and see him, right? Just come here, okay? Enjoy yourself. Okay. 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 So, wow, Uncle is very nice. <laughs> oh, this is the one. Oh, this is the one. 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 This is the like you know, in charge of the kitchen and everything, but his son is also here to help out, you know. Okay, so uh, we got this chicken rice right here. I don't know what's the weight, I'll be very honest guys, I really don't know what's the weight of everything. This is probably like seven pounds or more, this whole mountain right here. We got uh, chicken feet right here, crystal, they call it crystal chicken feet. We got some acha, this is free flow actually. So if you guys come here and eat, you guys get this free flow, you can help yourself with this thing. The soup, yeah, this soup is also like, they will give you guys one bowl of soup with a generous amount of the cabbage. And this is, this one will change every day. They are on a rotational basis for this soup. Okay, so uh, yeah, let's try to finish all of this. Let's not waste their effort. Let's get started. All right, so this is the chicken rice. Uh, I'm just gonna try to eat with some urgency today because if I'm gonna drag, right? This place is gonna be crazy packed, and I don't want to film when this place is crazy packed. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna walk you guys through what I got in this plate. Half is white chicken, steam ones. The other half is a roast chicken. Okay, we got like uh, some some of the ch uh, chicken skin here. I try to transfer some of the stuff over to my big plate so it's easier to eat. Uh, we got some of the what do you call it? Liver, the intestines here. Uh, some acha, this this acha, this salad thing. It's actually free flow. You guys can help yourself. Eggs. Yeah, pretty much that's it. Okay, uh, I've got some ginger chili by the side, which I probably will be using as I as I, as I go along. Okay, but uh, now I'm talking. Let's get started. Hey, three, two, one. Let's go. Okay, Katong famous, boneless, delicious chicken rice. Okay, I know what you guys are thinking. I'm just gonna give you guys my unbiased, honest opinion of this chicken rice. Okay, so I'm just gonna mention uh, about what I think is really good about this chicken rice and what I think is not that good about this chicken rice. A lot of protein on this plate. But it's okay, I need it. I did legs today, so I need to try to get all that protein, protein in. What I really like is the fact that they serve you the chicken rice along with soup. And the soup is not just plain soup, it's like soup with a bunch of cabbage, which got flavour in it. Do you usually put the ginger as well? I put it inside. I think it's garlic, it's not ginger. 
they also serve you this free flow uh, this salad thing which is uh, they call it acha in Singapore we call it acha it's like a blend of uh, cucumbers onions carrots and pineapples which is very very refreshing I like that thing a lot Okay, so um, the chicken wise, they actually added this roasted garlic on the chicken, which brings out a lot of flavor. I really enjoy the chili. This is one of the few stalls that both the steamed chicken and the roast chicken are equally good. The rice, uh, the rice is not too oily. The rice is, yeah, it's not too oily. So if you guys are not a fan of oily chicken rice, this is this is definitely the place for you. And then the sauce, they actually gave you this, uh, they have three types of sauce. One is the black sauce, which is the black soy sauce, kind of sweet. The rice at the bottom, is still hot. Uh, the chili, which I really like. The chili is actually a little bit spicy. I'm missing the Thanos layer. A little bit sweet actually. Oh, the legendary artifact. Very rare that you get chicken rice chili that's a little bit sweet. It's a little bit sweet, a little bit sour. They actually sprinkle some of the toasted garlic on top of the chicken, like a good amount. Which, I like it, it makes it very fragrant. Like, I've never had chicken rice with toasted garlic on top. And this is like the ginger that you can add in. Like, uh, yeah, minced puree ginger. Uh, I like it. And then they, they actually give you this uh, puree ginger thing. Actually, you know what? I'm not afraid of spice anymore. Which actually goes very well with the chicken as well. Okay, so now, now I'm going to mention what didn't really make the cut for me. I think the rice lacks flavour. It's a good thing that the rice is not that oily and all. You know what? I think they use really big chickens. Their chi they use quite big, their chicken is quite big. It's only half chicken each and it's like, it's a lot. Eh? But it lacks that, that chicken flavour that's coming from the stock, oh. coming from the broth. Carry soup is good as well. Yeah, I think that is something that is missing or is not that strong uh, in this specific uh, chicken rice store. Look at it. Oh, they're, they're chicken. Oh. Chicken are big. But other than that, I would say everything is soy sauce. up there. Everything is really up there. And then I'll mix in a bit of that ginger as well. So you got all three components in this, in this bite. Okay, so apart from that, uh, definitely they are above average for sure. Uh, is this the best chicken rice in Singapore? It's very hard for me to actually say if, if, if it's the best chicken rice in Singapore because when it comes to chicken rice, it's very subjective. Different people have their different favorite stalls. So it's very hard for me or anyone to name this specific store and say like, oh, it's the best in Singapore. Yeah, I like the fact, yeah. And they give you this kind of, all this like, free flow acha. I think it's very refreshing. When we eat and you start to get tired of the chicken rice, you eat some of this, we'll keep you going. Okay, the next video, right, I'm gonna push. I'm not gonna be you know, mukbang style, I'm gonna eat quicker because Mervin said if I finish whatever food in the next video within like 20 or 30 minutes, it's gonna confess to a girl. It's gonna like, you know, ask a girl out. Okay, so I'm sure you guys are gonna ask me like what's my favorite what's my top chicken rice in Singapore I don't really have a favorite but I'm just gonna name like three to four stalls that I personally I like to go and like I like the most uh, one is Loiki at Balestia still intact still intact Steve never drop never keep ball. second one is the one at Ishun I think it's called Ishun 925 chicken rice third one is Widamki I mean, that's one thing, guys. 90% of the people that come to this coffee shop, this place, here to order their chicken rice. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, I mean, like, but it's, it's the fact. Everyone is just here to eat the chicken rice. What? The yeah, store owner will come and dislike my video. Okay, this is actually uh, chicken liver. I think it's liver. I ran out of chili. Eh? There's one more which is uh, it's no longer around. Uncle Sky. It used to be at Maxwell. So this fall is like among all the chicken rice I've tasted over the years. I think this fall is the best. 
Okay, go ahead and enjoy the rest of the video. Uh, if you guys are in the East or Katong area, I highly recommend you guys to actually pop by and try out their chicken rice. Uh, yeah, and do comment down below on your favorite chicken rice as well. Okay, so for chicken rice, right, there are three components for me. The rice, the chicken, and the chili. This one hit all three. Okay, the chili is good not overly spicy or maybe i don't know my spice tolerance improved uh, it's really not spicy at all uh, the chicken especially the steamed one is super super tender very very moist the rice pretty good it's not oily uh, and it has this yellow yellowish color on the rice i don't know why but it has this like yellow the rice is not exactly white it's like yellow maybe they added turmeric i don't know but very good It's really good, I got like a mirror right here. Okay, done. Thank you. Okay, so done with the uh, chicken rice. I, I cannot say it's the best chicken rice, okay, but it's definitely one of the better ones. Chicken rice is very subjective. So my personal favorite and all of you guys might be very, very different. There's, there's a couple of things that I really like. One is the soup. They give you a soup full of like cabbage inside, which is, which is a good thing. Like, when you order a plate, you get all these like plus items, all these add-ons that is like free flow. You get an acha. Acha, okay, acha is a salad. Okay, it's like a, it's like a little salad thing with like pineapples, cucumbers, uh, onions, that sort of thing. And then you get a bowl of like a nice bowl of soup. So yeah, if you guys are in the area, I do recommend this place. Please pop by, try. But do take note that there will be a queue. I was here since four, three thirty, and now it's about six. Okay, uh, the queue is like there's always a line of like four to five percent, always. So yeah, do take note that you guys have to wait for a little bit. Finally, you know, we come all the way here to film this video for you guys. I'm supposed to film boba, but I haven't decided which one to, you know, which boba should I go. Uh, I'm just deciding between uh, Playmate or Haiti. This two. Okay, but yeah, that's it. That's it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, not this again, please.